MMORPGs on mobile are a genre that people are always searching for, desiring an open world that they can explore and do it with other people while diving themselves into rich story and insane battle mechanics. So today I want to share with you 10 from this genre that are still active today, that have strong communities and that are worth you diving into. So let's dive into my list of 10. Starting out the list, we have one of the newer titles called Tower of Fantasy with 5 million downloads and 3.9 stars. Inside of this game, you're going to have something very similar to a Genshin Impact experience where you take your characters into the battles that's more of a story driven line than a PvP related one. It's one that's got great graphics, tons of customization, and a world that's forever taking shape. You're always going to have new missions to embark on and something to do inside of the game, mini games that pop up on a regular basis, and new characters that will come into the game also on a regular basis. This one is definitely a solid one if you're looking for an anime-inspired MMORPG. I want to thank Raid Shadow Legends for sponsoring today's video and let all of you know that you could play alongside of me. I have a QR code and a link in the description of this video that'll get you a free champion, Rector Drath, and a bunch of rewards. The cheat code inside of Raid that you can start with right now today. And on top of that, guys, I'm covering the game, putting out videos every single day on my second channel called Echo Raid Shadow Legends. Come on over, drop a sub, and show some support. And even right now, there's an event going on that gives you a whole bunch of free stuff that you could win. I'm talking about gaming consoles, Amazon gift cards for hundreds of bucks. You gotta use springhunt.plarium.com. I'll be leaving the link down below so you can head on over there to participate and hopefully win yourself a new gaming console or some cash. Not a bad idea. And inside of the game, for more free rewards, you can use promo code SPRINGHUNT24 to get some stuff to help you out inside of the game. So you could smack around a spider a little bit more. At the end of the day, these champions, they're my homies. I get to know them. I get to love them. I get to build them and feel that connection. Raid Shadow Legends allows me to do all of that. I love playing Raid. I love getting my battles in every single day, and I think you will too. So right now, use the QR code or my link in the description to download the game and play alongside of me. And you could even come join me in my clan, Echo Raid. Looks like we have a spot open. I'll see you guys in Raid and over on my second YouTube channel. Next on the list today is a game that's been around for years with 10 million downloads and 4.1 stars. I present to you Black Desert Mobile, one of the best MMORPGs in the mobile space. This one also being on PC as well. Its title has so much story, so much depth to the point where you will never be able to understand everything about the game. All right, well, maybe that's a bit of an exaggeration, but there is so much inside of the game and always consistent updates coming to the game that you're not going to find yourself being bored. Whether you are upgrading your little shadowy creature that comes alongside of you or all of your weapons and gear, you're going to be able to explore a beautiful open world with some insane mechanics that you could utilize inside of battle. The game really allows you to do everything from farming up your materials to creating all the gear that you need for the battles. And as you can see, even a little bit of fishing. The game is so much fun, massive, as you would expect from an MMORPG, and something that is still solid to this day. Next, we have one of my favorite MMORPGs on the list today being Albion Online with 10 million downloads and 4.5 stars. When you embark on this journey, you are doing it on a single server, one server where everyone that plays this game lives. Whether you're a brand new player, or someone that's been playing for years, you are in the same world, in the same realm as everyone else, embarking in battles with those same people. I think that's something that's really cool because there's a lot of people that you can meet inside of the game, team up with, become alliance mates with, and really work together for the greater good, to protect everything that you've created and to steal the things that you want inside of the game. It really is done well with a simplistic graphic style that I think looks quite nice. It's a solid, well put together MMORPG that's here to stay. Next we have Diablo Immortal, which is stretching it a little bit. This is more of an action RPG, although it does offer an open world experience as well where you can play with others. This one has 10 million downloads and 4.6 stars. Inside of Diablo Immortal, you're able to play a ton of different game modes with seven different classes. 
very soon to be eight different class choices inside of the game. At any point in time, you can change your class to play as a different type inside of the game as well, all free of charge. This game has so many options for you as far as gameplay mechanics, gameplay modes, and different types of PvE and PvP, with updates coming monthly on a pretty big status as well. The next incoming update is gonna redo the Paragon system as well as bring a brand new class to the game called the Tempest, the controller of wind and water. That's coming in just about a week's time, and I highly suggest you download this one and check it out. In addition, I do have a second YouTube channel where I cover Diablo Immortal, and that one's called Echo Gaming Diablo, bringing you everything you need to know about this action RPG. But yes, I did put it in the MMORPG genre, and that is because it does have itself a nice world that is shared between players, both in open world and in PvP status. Just a really great game overall. Next up is Torum Online MMORPG, also with 10 million downloads and 4.5 stars. As you can tell from this one, the graphics are a little bit Zelda-esque looking, but the open world is something that's definitely enjoyable to explore. Although the gameplay may seem a little bit more rudimentary or maybe even I should say old school than some of the others doesn't mean that the gameplay experience isn't a positive and really robust one. The game has competitive multiplayer as well as casual single player experiences for you as well. You could play this one however you desire. The Legend of Neverland with 10 million downloads, 4.3 stars, another MMORPG role-playing game that is heavily focused on both anime and a single player experience. Inside of this one, you're gonna find yourself in a lighter, more happy looking world than some of the other games that we've seen on the list here today. And it's one that has some really beautiful character customizations and overall artwork inside of the game of its own. You have a massive world to explore, all that is very different looking, different looking realms from the flowers to the winter months. You're gonna be able to make your way around this game and enjoy everything that it has to offer. Definitely a nice experience for all you anime fans looking for a large open world. Next, we have Perfect World Mobile that's been out for quite some time. It has a million downloads and 3.5 stars. An MMORPG game that really takes you into the roots of Japan and allows you to meet many different phantom beasts and different characters along the way. The game looks really cool, it plays really well, and as I mentioned, it's been around for quite some time, so the player base is fairly solid at that. I like how you could build out your characters inside of this game and the big battles that you'll get yourself into against some large enemies that are going to come in your way. Just a really nice game that's put together over in Japan, made by Perfect World Games, that is really probably worth your time if you're a fan of the genre. Now I'm going to completely flip the script on you and introduce you to Eve Echoes, another title with 1 million downloads, 4.1 stars, and this is an MMORPG strategy game that takes you up into space. Yes, it is from the very, extremely, very, very popular Eve Echoes, now having an online version, this coming from NetEase Games. For someone that's an enthusiast of things that happen up in space but want that large gaming experience, Eve Echoes is a title that gives you exactly that. You won't be disappointed. This game has a ton of depth, a ton of players, and is a ton of fun. Next up, we have Dragon Raja with 5 million downloads, 3.9 stars, an MMORPG game that prides itself on character customization, a massive open world to explore, and some really nice battle mechanics. As you can see, the customization options are very in-depth for those of you that like to really dress up your character before you get yourself into action. It's also a very colorful, bright, and happy looking game. Some people are looking for an experience that brings them into that bright world, and Dragon Raja is a game that does exactly that. With many different classes to choose from, lots of appearances to create, this is a fun one for some of you that have that artisticness that you want to explore. And RuneScape is the epitome of an open world MMORPG experience where you get to play with others. With 3.1 stars on mobile and 1 million downloads, this title is exactly what you'll remember from days of old playing RuneScape on PC. The graphics are old school looking, but you know what? That kind of brings in the charm of the game that people really do love. And as you can see, you could play it both on mobile and on PC. 
Seven Nights 2 sits with 1 million downloads and 3.6 stars. It has some new mythical pets that you can bring into your battles with you. And the game has been around for approximately three years. A big battle mechanic style title right here for those of you that really want some serious action. And if you're looking for gameplay titles just like these, make sure you subscribe to the channel because every single day I'm bringing you top 10 lists, offering you experiences that you can play inside of many different mobile games across the space, as well as free to play games on Steam and PC. I hope to see you guys back here tomorrow. Let me know in the comments section below if you made it until the end of the video.